How's it going everyone? Scaredy Cat Vasquez back at it with another video for a while and it's been a while. It has been. I missed you all so much. But um, I can I can happily say that I have now found a, a better job which would lead into a good career and it's providing me a good schedule as well. Something where I can evenly split my work and provide time to my creating and entertaining time. So be sure to like stick around if this is your first time and you're thinking who is this guy why is he saying all this I've been I've been on a hiatus I got married I was in between jobs and just you know trying to find steady ground but I I'm happily to announce that I found it so be on the lookout for this like and subscribe uh, follow me on Instagram you'll find out more information uh, during my hiatus I was doing a little bit of stuff especially on a new platform I have been on I've been on Twitch for about a few months now and it's pretty fun I love communicating with people I love talking to friends inviting them over and we just you know play different random games mostly dead by daylight because that game is awesome and I don't want to brag but I fucking murder on that game so I'm really I'm really looking forward to seeing you guys there so be sure to like subscribe follow on all those different platforms you can find all that information down below and let's just get right into it okay This is the first thing I want to talk about because it was the first sign that that I got and that was like a confirm we might have a normal hunt season this year. Hi there, editing me. So I made a mistake and I was saying Plague Productions when I should have been saying 13th Floor Entertainment, which is still a group that Johnny Plague is still a part of. So I'm half right, half wrong. Uh, just wrong title. I don't, I don't know. Either way, it's it's it doesn't change my opinion on it. It's still gonna be an amazing thing, and I'm really looking forward to it. But I do apologize for the misunderstanding. But I hope you enjoy the rest of the video. Delusion and Plague Productions are two great companies standing alone, but together they are definitely gonna make something that we're gonna talk about for years to come. We are gonna be so thrilled and scared and just mesmerized over the the combination of great set design and props and decorations as well as great cast and wonderful theoretic skills and storytelling probably messed up that word theoretical the wonderful theater skills is what i meant to say <laughs> There isn't that much information, you can definitely follow them on Instagram as well as other platforms, I believe Twitter as well, and you can find out, wait and see just like the rest of us because that's all we can do. If I had more information, I'd love to tell you, but I, I don't. I don't. So so yeah, we're just going to wait and see. I trust Johnny Plague. I've, I've met the guy, I've talked to him, and I've of course we've all seen his work. We've seen everything he's done for Scary Farm, Dark Harbor, and all the other haunts he's done around the country for 13th Floor Entertainment, as well as Plague Productions. So, I'm just, I, I have full confidence in both of them. I've seen Delusion, not as, in a show, but I've seen a lot of their background backstage work. And I've talked to some cast members, and oh my god, they are, they are, they're both amazing. So, we're in for a good treat. We're really in for a good treat. Second announcement. I want to get into all these photos and videos that are be coming around, coming about, popping all over the place. Universal was the first one I saw, Knott's Berry Farm was the second, and we see here that they are set designs, they're, set, they're, they're building stuff. What are they building, hmm? We all know what they're building. We all definitely know what they're building, they're, except for this photo right here, because this was in the exact same location as... Shadowlands, but we all know Shadowlands is going to be no longer with us. It already ran its course approximately about like four years of uh, being at Scary Farm, which is, in my opinion, too short. I loved Shadowlands so much. Another great play productions setup right there. And you can see a video, you can see a video I done back then saying goodbye to such an amazing, such an amazing maze like that one. So 
every year we see photos like these popping around like, oh, they're starting building. They're starting to build. What are they gonna build? This and that. But I believe it was back in 2018 or 2019 that we've been tricked and bamboozled. There was some devil on a building that we all thought was gonna be like a devil theme maze. But nope, it was a wax theme maze. It was a haunted wax museum type of maze, which is of course Waxworks, which was a really great maze. Uh, one thing I loved about it, they really used their sense of like climate control, I guess you can call it. They, uh, you know, the heat in that in that maze was just all the way up, so it made you feel uncomfortable, and it was just, you know, it was really put you in that place, you know. So it was it was great. I will admit too that the one time I went to that maze, I I literally thought I was gonna have a heart attack, and I even had the scare actress um, ask if I was okay. Like, she didn't break character. She still had her creepy voice on, but she made she made sure to be like, "Hey, are you, are you good? You good?" <laughs> and last but not least, we have a haunt that I'm I'm not gonna lie to you guys. I thought was done for. I thought they were done with. I thought that they were not gonna be coming back. But nope, they came back with a surprise. I've never been to this I've never been to this hunt before and I really did not want to miss it out on this especially if this was only going to be their one and only event that they're going to put through which I highly doubt after all the hype that it's been getting now they're definitely going to want to come back and I hope they do I hope they can really put something together to to help them keep putting more things together if you catch my drift I just really hope that you know that this haunt will stay around especially to come back for 2021 haunt season because after everything we went through last year we can definitely use this great haunt to come back and rise from the ashes and really put on a great show and that is of course reign of terror reign of terror is doing something for the month of april i believe putting together a halfway to halloween celebration still doing their enormously long and never-ending hallways of terror that just rain upon you i get it rain of terror look at that watch out but still they are definitely something you don't want to miss i highly recommend getting your tickets ticket link down below let them know who sent you i hope to see you there i hope to see you there and i hope we can all just get scared together just like old times i really miss walking through a maze i'm not the only one leave a comment down below what is the one maze that you truly miss? It could be from something of 2019. It could be even something from 2020 because we had some amazing home haunts still going on. Which you know they're still going to be going on this year. And after all the hype and they've really proven themselves, which they didn't really need to in the first place because we've always known home haunts to be a great source of entertainment and scares. But they really had the spotlight on them last year and they really did not fail with providing good old fashioned Halloween fun. But let me know what is something that, what is the one maze that you miss? And that you can, if you could, you can go back in time and go through again and again and again. I'm gonna let you know mine. Of course, I've said it before. I've said it a thousand times and I'll say it a thousand more. I miss the Red Barn, the Red Barn and the Slaughterhouse. I love that crazy, Hills Have Eyes, Texas Chainsaw, crazy redneck type of stuff, man. That's, that's, that's my thing right there. I love that. I've shared mine. You share yours. Like and subscribe. Thank you for watching all the way to the end. This is the announcements that we know so far. There's more to come. And definitely there's going to be more videos to come too. So stay tuned. I love you all. And I'll see you all next time.